All right, Northern Tesla back with another FSD beta drive. We are um, going to go to Costco. So we have a short drive, about uh, 10 kilometers or so, and it's going to involve some uh, residential as well as some city driving. So here we are. Our first is our left-hand turn. Uh, I didn't have to disengage, but that truck was a little close for my liking, but uh, it still handled all right. Now, first off, on the right here, we got some road debris. Uh, I did disengage just to be sure. Uh, it, it looks like a bunch of leaves, so I'm sure it would have been fine if I didn't, but uh, I like to be safe as always. So first off is a right turn off a stop sign. I find it handles the stop signs really well, so no complaints there on that turn. So with these FSD beta videos, I'm going to try to put the car into some complicated situations, but at least see what the car is capable of. Now, coming up is this intersection where it's a bit of an odd setup. You can see from the overhead, uh, I'm going to be in this left lane here, and the oncoming traffic isn't quite aligned, so you got to wait for it. And if you're making that left turn, it's kind of a weird angle. So you can see coming up that uh, there's a lot, it's like the intersection just isn't lined up properly. And you can see, oh, the car wasn't sure exactly what lane it was going to be in. And you can see it adjusted to go into this left lane where it should be. So that's good. Now you can see up above all the uh, street lights. There's your oncoming, my oncoming red light is there, as well as the cross traffic green light is up above as well. So the car sees both and uh, it knows which light is associated to my lane. So it knows not to go on that green light. All right, as the cross traffic is slowing down, you can see this uh, black truck here. It kind of slowed down and it really is, went ahead of the line. So it made the turn quite harder than it should have been. So I did have to disengage there just because the, the, it's quite a sharp turn I had to make. So there's two disengagements. So here we are with another right turn. It uh, light just turned green. So it handled that really smoothly. So with these uh, FSD beta videos, uh, let me know in the comments what you guys like, what you guys don't like. Obviously, I haven't made these types of videos before, so just let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll just make it happen. All right, so we're coming up to another left-hand turn. This is a uh, all stop or a three-way stop. Uh, there is a car you can't see uh, making a left turn on the other side, so we're just going to wait our turn, and uh, off we go. Now we're coming up to more in-town driving with a few uh, green lights. Now we're going to be making a left turn coming up into one of these plazas for the Costco. Now this type of driving is uh, similar to what FSD is already capable of. Just now you don't have to acknowledge the uh, red lights, or the green lights, sorry. So we are making this uh, left turn following this car behind. Now there is a bit of a row, so I'm not sure if we're going to make this light or wait for the next one.
so it looks like we're gonna make the green here. Uh, here we go. Now you can see up ahead there is a white SUV. It's kind of making the left turn a bit blind. But the car's confident that I can see ahead and behind it that there are no cars coming. And it made that turn quite comfortably. Very confident in that turn. Now up ahead, here we are with the Costco. Just up ahead, we are gonna make another left turn into the parking lot. And as you can see, uh, with all Costco's, there's always busy. And uh, you're gonna see lots of cars coming in and out. And we're gonna try to see if we can squeeze in there. Now, constantly going into that left uh, turn lane, doesn't hesitate at all, goes right into it, which is uh, really nice. It lets cars behind you know that where you're going. Like I said, a couple cars coming out, does some cars going in. It's a busy little spot, so um, cars doing a good job at waiting its turn, being patient. And then moving when it's appropriate. So that, yeah, this car just goes left. Then it's gonna wait for this oncoming car. And it looks like it's clear to go, so. So on the way back, everything looked good again, no issues. Here we are back at the, the intersection. It's a bit tight coming on this side, making that left turn. Uh, it's a tight uh, road here. And again, it's really comfortable. No issues here. Now coming up on the right, you can see a bicyclist. Uh, the car does slow down. It kind of moves over just a slide to the left, but it does slow down for it. Obviously very cognizant of that bicycle there. So. So we're almost home, uh, back to, we're gonna be coming up to that intersection, uh, that weird one again. This time it's gonna be just a right hand turn. However, it is a bit of a weird angle again. It's kind of steep. So I'm expecting the car to slow down quite a bit because if you do take that at any speed, it is a bit wonky. Uh, so coming up here, just wanna signal right and just uh, dump off that speed, make that good turn. And uh, yeah, really good job here again. 
So on the way there, they, we had two disengagements. Uh, one, obviously, just a bit of debris on the road. I'm sure I didn't have to disengage, but I was just being better safe than sorry. And the other one, a really tight situation. Again, probably wouldn't have crashed or anything or hit that car, but again, just trying to be safe. And the way back, obviously, no disengagements. So this is a good drive, a good uh, showing of the capabilities of FSD Beta currently. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And uh, like I said before, please give a comment. Let me know what you like, what you don't like, what you'd like to see in the future with these FSD beta videos. And don't forget to subscribe. Uh, keep up to date with the progress of FSD as well as my regular content, which will be coming out as well. Anyways, thanks again for watching and uh, we'll see you soon.